It is called vitiligo. Vitiligo is a non-contagious chronic skin disorder that causes white patches of skin appearance on different parts of the body. Due to the problem in the skin that kills the cells that produce the brown pigments that give all of us the coloring of our skin. And therefore, sufferers start having this light skin or whitening of their skin. Vitiligo affects exposed parts of the body like the hands, face, upper parts of the chest, leg, body folds, armpit and sites of injury. Statistics reveal that 1-2% to of the world's population, including Nigeria, has vitiligo, while 95% of people with this skin disorder, in spite of not being a rare disorder or being classified as a disease by the World Health Organization, is one of the most psychologically, psychosocially and emotionally devastating chronic skin disorders, with a major impact on both patients and their families as they have more than just skin condition to cope with. I've passed through a lot of insults, a lot of pain, not because of it is go. I can't shake somebody with my hands sometimes, I don't like shaking. Because I've been in the church that I want to shake it. The pastor said that we should shake. I wanted to shake a lady, the lady does remove his hands. So I was ashamed, I was even crying. It's normal, they will look at you. When they look at you, then I will look at them back. If they ask questions, then I will answer them. If they want to know more about it, I will answer them. As common as the disorder is, many people have never heard about it. It's like, oh, no, no, I'm not. No, not very sure at this moment, so I can't tell you something authoritative. So I don't know what called that uh, vitiligo. I've never heard of it. It was for public enlightenment on vitiligo that the Vitiligo Support and Awareness Foundation was established with the aim also to improve the quality of life of persons distressed with the disorder. I'm using Dongoyaro leaf, carrot trees, and I use fresh life soap to bath. So when we take more of, more of uh, carrot and more of lemon, lemon juice, it let the skin get more darker somehow. Dr. Femi Olaleye has been working to improve the quality of life of persons with vitiligo. People uh, have lost jobs, they've lost friends, they've lost relationships because people think this condition is contagious. But it is not. It is a skin problem that does not get transmitted to somebody else. And uh, it's still one of those things we as doctors still struggling to find a cure for. So which means even difficult for people who suffer from it uh, to, to seek help. Message here is, the next time you come across people with white patches on their skin, do not run away. It is not transferable. That's just the way they are. Even the world famous pop music star, the late Michael Jackson, reportedly suffered this skin disorder.